A father-daughter duo is making great music. Composer Bill Purcell and his daughter Laura are teaming up on a new CD and a rare performance at Vitello's in Studio City this weekend. Their special guest is Donnie Most, best known for his role on Happy Days. Bill and Laura join me now live here in studio. Welcome to you both. We were just talking Thank about Vitello's. What a great space to be in. Oh, it's going to be so beautiful. And with the new remodel we were just talking about, mm -hmm. it's it, it's a gorgeous venue and it's perfect because it's kind of a retro place for a retro collection of songs. Now we're talking about um, a new CD that's coming up. Are you going to be debuting some of those songs? We're going to be playing all of them. Um, from the very last dance hall left in LA, which we have right here. And uh, Donnie Most is going to be coming in. We're going to sing a couple of duets and mm -hmm. we're going to feature him for a few songs. And you're going to get to hear dad's arrangements exactly the way we recorded in, in the studio in Nashville. And talking about um, your, your history here, I have in my hand here one of your older um, records, Vinyls. Vinyl. Which is amazing to see and to read the back. Um, Bill, tell us a little bit about uh, this, this performance itself. Well, first of all, I'm laughing my head off because you finally found that thing. <laughs> <laughs> it's it out there. Back, it goes back way, way back into prehistoric times. But anyway, mm -hmm. uh, I did that um, in, uh, I good Lord, the, in the 60s, probably about 65 or 66 mm -hmm. in, uh, in Nashville. I was working for a fellow named Bill Beasley. We were doing a lot of cover sessions. Mm -hmm. And um, he wanted me to put this thing out. So I actually recorded that on a spinet piano in his little studio with the basement. And I had absolutely no idea he was going to go and do that, you know. Are you still on a regular piano today? Or are you on a keyboard? How have things changed oh, yeah, over the years? Oh, yeah, definitely. Regular keyboard's what I prefer, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, and when we were in the studio, Dad has amazing time. And I remember you, you didn't even want to work with the click track, which is pretty amazing. What's a click track? A Explain click track it. It keeps everything in time, and, okay. and you have it in your phone. He doesn't, he doesn't want to use it, but he has perfect time. Mm -hmm. And the engineer said, oh, my God. He, he said, I want everybody in the studio to give acknowledgement to Bill Purcell, who can play without a click track. Right. <laughs> now, Donnie Most. Your special um, guest this weekend, not someone that we would really associate with being a singer. We, again, see he's him mostly wonderful. as the Happy Days gang. He's, he's wonderful. He's so charismatic and fun, and he kind of adds a lightness to everything. Mm -hmm. So, um, And we sing pretty well together, so I think that's going to be a lot of fun. I think people are in for a treat. And Matello's is known for having a lot of jazz performances there. Can you explain a little bit about what you're going to be doing? Well, we're going to be doing the 10 tracks off of the album, and mm -hmm. we're going to be supplementing it with a few jazz standards. And I'm hoping that Dad will do his 1963 hit, Our Winter Love. Mm -hmm. Are you up for that? Oh, yeah. Okay. So we'll do it. We'll, we'll do that. And he doesn't need the click track. He can go right <laughs> no. off memory, right? You can just go right <laughs> off memory. <laughs> I, 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 if, if people aren't familiar with it, they, they reissued the track in a compilation for Austin Powers' music to shag by. Oh, my goodness. So if oh, you yeah. happen to have that in your that. collection, Our Winter Love, I believe, is track number seven or eight. I'll have to look that up as well. well. My it's son pretty came groovy. In, my son came in and said, Dad, do you realize that, that uh, Austin Powers is using Winter Love as number eight on his music, on his CD to, music to shag by. <laughs> and I, You've come full circle. I, said, I called CBS in New York, Sony Records, rather. Uh -huh. and they did. I'm obviously somebody did it. I mean, you know, actually, you can find it all over YouTube. Uh, once you do it, you really don't own it anymore. You know. Yeah, you put it out there, but so many more generations get to enjoy it. And that's um, right. Oh yeah. And, and this is the tenth year. Ten years ago, you were at Vitello's, right? So this right. is a, kind of a comeback. For yeah. You guys. And ten years ago, when we did the show, we kind of threw it together. It was a slapdash kind of thing. I said, Let, let's do a show. You're coming to town. I called my friends. Everybody showed up. We packed the house, and we just did a bunch of songs from the American Songbook. And I think you did our winter love. Mm -hmm. And people sat in. We had it was such an incredibly musical night. It was a lot of fun. And and I'm hoping we can get that same kind of energy this Sunday. And Bill, are you still writing and composing today? Oh yeah. yeah. I just finished a bluegrass opera about two years ago. We're going to do a showcase with the thing at, in uh, Belmont University where I've been teaching since yeah. 1980. And uh, we won't have the bluegrass group, but it's not a bluegrass, bluegrass opera because mm -hmm. it has its Puccini moments, you know. Right. But it's about the life of Andrew Jackson. And um, um, a friend of mine wrote the, the um, book for it, the, um, you know, 
right now I'm, I'm missing a name here. What? Fred Birch. Fred Birch, of mm -hmm. course. Wrote the book. And, um, and oddly enough, Fred was actually part writer on one of the songs that we did on the album a long time yeah. ago. Well, I don't want to stop you guys, but we're running out of time. There's so oh. many great stories to tell here. And of course, music is in the heart, right? Right. Again, you can catch their show with special guest Donnie Most this Sunday at 8 and 10 o'clock. It's at Vitello's on Tahunga Avenue in Studio City. For more information about Bill and Laura Purcell and their show and all their projects, just go to our website, kcal9.com. Click Scene on TV. So